serious bit of kit. Whoever's moored it though, it looks like it's got just the one rope holding it tight. It didn't have to come in close. This is um, Semaphore de Cap Cisse and that is looking over towards Toulon. Toulon way off in the distance. Down there somewhere is Gianti and not far away from that is a, a beach with a, a, a load of naked people on. I don't know what they're doing. Good Lord. Um, we get quite a good view right the way around here. It's quite a place. Up there on the hill is a little church. where we've been for the last few nights. We're leaving here today and the nearest beach, no wind. But we're uh, we're gonna go to past this cool little bit on the end here with this house and a big tunnel through the rock. Pretty smart. We're gonna go around the corner to La Ciotat. And then we're going to hit the Calanques, and then Marseille, and then Barcelona. Lucia Tap Marina. We are anchored in the bay outside. We found this cool bull. How many can you name of all the famous people? We've had Clark Gable, we've had Rita Hayworth, we think it's Lana Turner. He's pretty cool. This is a uh, statue of Jules Lenoir who invented the game of Patank because he was a bit too old to play bowls. And that's in 1908 in La Ciotat. Don't do it, it's not that desperate. You've never seen a dive like this before. You show all those teenagers jumping off rocks. Please, I need to concentrate. One, two, trois. Encore! The church at the top of uh, Church of Notre Dame at the top of La Ciotat. Figaro. Then you've got the Calanques. We've got the Calanc to figure roll down there, which you can't quite see. We've got the boats anchored just out on that side. And we are anchored just opposite there on the other side. There's a little island there.
adventures and walks. Come for a little walk, he says. Just a little, little stroll to the beach. I oh know, bring your bikini out for a walk. <laughs> it is really lovely if everyone gets to experience this. Because it's absolutely beautiful, but the amount of traffic that comes in and out of here is just crazy. And the amount of people on the beach. So when we climbed here years ago, you can see the sun and the shadows come on the walls if the sun moves around. So around four o'clock-ish, that whole beach will be in shade. And that's when all the climbers come out and they all start putting all their climbing gear on and they go off up to the climbing areas all in the background there. And climb for hours. They walk. A bon anniversary, poor fool. National holiday as well. Celebrating style. Is it is is that, is that a coincidence, eh? I think. <laughs>